Hi, my name is John Perkins, and I will be giving a presentation on the artist Roger Vander Veden. Roger Vander Veden was born in 1399 in Ternay, France, uh, which is actually now Belgium. He died June 18th, 1464 in Brussels. Um, he worked as an apprentice to a painter and then later became a master painter. Um, it was disputed whether or not it was in actually 1464 or 1432 because there were some records indicating that he was actually a master painter in 1426 at the time when um, he actually became a master painter in 1432. Um, he's one of the most important French or Flemish painters of his time. Um, he primarily painted altarpieces and triptychs. Uh, triptychs are um, pieces of uh, art that are generally cut out into uh, three portions. They're triptychs, or um, sometimes they're in two portions, and uh, and they fold um, and they open up kind of like a book, I guess. Um, he focused on the facial features in his artworks of the people and uh, accentuated the, uh, the way their faces looked. Um, and most of his work is actually presumed to be lost. Um, that's because he rarely signed his art. The piece that I will be um, dissecting, I guess, would be the Seven Sacraments altar piece that he painted. Um, this piece focused on Christianity, which is a recurring theme in, in this time period. Um, in the 15th century, um, in the heat of the Renaissance, a lot of artists, um, that's the centerpiece of their, of their work is, is Christianity. Um, and as you can see, there's Christ, um, on the crucifix right there in the middle of the, uh, of the painting in the, in the big, um, altarpiece. Um, and around him are, are people who looks to be sad and, and distraught, I guess. Um, he uses vibrant colors, um, with the reds and the blues and the, and the whites, and they really pop out against the white background. Um, and as you can tell, if you, if you zoom in on the picture or you look closely, uh, the facial features of, of every uh, character in this, in this artwork are very uh, highlighted or accentuated. They, uh, he spent a lot of time um, making sure that the, the faces of these people are, are, are unique to themselves and you can distinguish each each uh, part of their face um, another way to tell that this was uh, a common or the, the themes that he used were, were common to his time period where the use of linear perspective um, it looks as if uh, although it's a painting it um, you can tell that it's three-dimensional with uh, the perspective um, and the, the architecture in the painting with the high columns and, and the, big, uh, the big rooms and the dome uh, type ceiling is common uh, throughout the Renaissance in a lot of art and the actual architecture. Um, Van der Veden was, uh, was deeply admired and imitated by a lot of artists in this time period. And uh, he inspired a lot of people to, to create art that looked a lot like his or uh, use some of his ideas and this is uh, my work cited.